Hey, this is Jeremy from Reverb.com, and today we're going to talk Tina Weymouth of Talking Heads and Tom Tom Club fame. Tina was a super creative bass player who really had a knack for finding the perfect part for a song, a part that was hummable, danceable, grooved like crazy, and are super fun to play. Unlike a lot of players, Tina used all sorts of different basses. So maybe there's not one that really says Tina, but she did use a Mustang bass early on in her career. Um, she's used all sorts of custom basses. We've seen her playing Hofners, jazz basses. She really used whatever she needed to fit the part and the sound for the tune. Um, not to mention that Talking Heads and Tom Tom Club have both have long careers and a lot of different sounds and different styles. What struck me when learning some of Tina's lines is how simple they were, but how they really seemed to make the song. This reminded me a lot of Duck Dunn and James Jamerson, so it was no surprise to me when looking through some of her interviews that she mentioned both of those players as big influences on her. This line is a great example of, of her Motown influences. So when she plays, that's classic Motown stuff right there. Here's Found a Job off of more songs about buildings and food. This album Brian Eno produced, and you can really hear their art rock angular aspects come out. This is a super weird, great funky bass line that reminds me of 80s electro James Brown with a pick. Yeah, so Found a Job is a, a super cool line. It's highly melodic and it's kind of strange, especially against the, the guitar parts, which are super 16th heavy. Um, she's playing this very bouncy, melodic, kind of James Brown-esque parts with crazy slides, like this part. So that's this great slide from the root to the third and then this kind of big pull-offs, which are, which are super cool, and the phrase happens like... happens three times, so it's sort of like an odd number, and loops back around in the other part in a great way. I just love this line. It, I could play along to it kind of all day. So in addition to Talking Heads, Tina also had a side project with her husband, Chris, called Tom Tom Club. Tom Tom Club was way dancey and way cool. This is the song Genius of Love off their debut record. Part of what makes this bass line great is the wild slide that is really part of the line. It's not just like an accent or a fill. You know, it's part of the whole thing. Tina's lines are super fun to play and very inspiring. They're really accessible. You know, they're not a lot of notes. They're easy to learn. Put on Talking Heads or Tom Tom Club record and play along and have fun. Mm -hmm. 